The general diesel engine operating principles shown apply to diesel cars and pickup trucks as well as heavier duty diesel trucks, which are used in this video for illustrative purposes only. In diesel engines, the operating cycle starts with clean air being drawn into the cylinder, not a fuel-air mixture as in a conventional gasoline engine. The motion of the piston compresses the air, heating it to a high temperature. When the piston nears the top of the cylinder, fuel is injected under high pressure through a number of precisely machined holes in the tip of the fuel injector. The fuel enters the engine in the form of a fine spray, and the surface of each droplet quickly begins to vaporize on its path through the hot air. Spontaneous ignition takes place without the need for a spark and rapid expansion of the combusting mixture increases the pressure in the cylinder, forcing the piston down and powering the vehicle. When the piston is close to its lowest position, the exhaust valve starts to open and the exhaust stroke then drives the spent gases out of the combustion chamber and the cycle starts again. In conventional gasoline engines, a mixture of fuel and air is drawn into the cylinder, compressed by the motion of the piston and ignited by a spark as the piston nears the top of the cylinder. The resulting combustion generates pressure which forces the piston down to power the vehicle. 